Hello and welcome back to our Pokemon Storm Silver Nuzlocke. This is part 15 and we are here on the lighthouse balcony because for some reason I decided, hey, this place looks pretty, let's end off here. Why, you may ask? I really don't know. But I guess we can consider this like the midway point of the lighthouse. I think we have a couple of trainers to go. I think we might be on the floor below where Jasmine and Amphi are. So we'll get to those. We'll get to that part. And then hopefully we will go to Cyanwood. Which will be exciting because there will be a gym over there. Pretty sure there's legendaries over there, or at least legendary events, so that's kind of exciting. And encounters. Most importantly, in an Uzlock, you've got to be excited for encounters. But he's starting off with a water hole. Does a back jet. That did a lot. That was a crap jet. Okay. But we're going to go for the spark and we're going to destroy him because we are a strong Luxray. He doesn't know what hit him. Oh wow, crit for crit. We're going blow for blow right now. Okay, let's stop with the crits now. That's the crits for the episode done, right? That's all the crits I need. I don't want to see any more. I don't, I don't want to get killed. Okay, and then Pelipper. Well, I guess we can stay in against that. I would love it if this Luxray was to learn Crunch. Actually, I don't know. No, Crunch wouldn't be bad in Night Slash. I guess it depends. It could be. Oh, that's a dilemma for another time if we ever learn it. Okay, let's not start that dilemma in, in case. Are you really going to double protect now, Pelipper? Are you doing this? Are you double protecting on me? That's filthy. This Pelipper is a filthy toilet bird. You know that? That's exactly what it is. Look at that. Gone. Four times super effective spark. Not living. No crits. Which hopefully means all the crits are done for the episode, right? Right? I can't manage to smile either. Oh. Oh, that's kind of sad, actually. Damn. We find an effer. I mean, not the best item. It's an item that's always just sort of there. It's a good thing to have on hand, but nothing you're really excited about when you pick it up. You're like, yeah, an effort! Unless you're doing a Nuzlocke with a PP challenge in it, in which case, oh boy, that's your favorite IMC. We're pretty high up here. My bird Pokemon are in prime form. I'm leading with the wrong Pokemon. This isn't good. This, I mean, a Swablu. I could probably close combat Swablu, right? This is how you get Pokemon killed. Let's not. Let's just not. How about that? But I, I probably could. I, buff is buff. Buff is buff. Okay, it's a swab blue. It's not evolved. Was that not very effective? No, that wasn't neutral. Okay, for some reason I thought that was not very effective. I was like, what is it? <laughs> what type has it become? <laughs> is it a dragon already? That'd be something. That'd be kind of exciting, honestly. Uh, but with Staravia coming in here, I think we go into Carmex. Why Carmex, you may ask? I don't really know. I just don't want to use Luxray too much. I want to make sure everyone's getting XP. Anyone who's close to leveling up, I'm going to prioritize. All of that stuff. Uh, we do get Intimidated, but that shouldn't make too much of a difference because we're going for Surf anyway, because we want that powerful move. Endeavor actually takes effect. Wow, it does 8 damage. Wow, that's crazy. Oof. That's, that's real close, you know? That's real close. I'm still gonna upjet here. I know we did get intimidated, but I think we should still be fine. I have to potion. Because he could quick attack. That sucks. If we see quick attack right here, I'm gonna feel really happy that I made the right play. If we don't, I'm gonna be kind of upset that I didn't just upjet. And you have Endeavor again. Can you stop going for Endeavor? What is is Endeavor's PP five? It's five, right? It's not a lot, right? Because I, I will just potion through this. Whirlwind. That works. I I guess. I'll just double kick you in the face. You're gonna double team. Endeavor Whirlwind. Is that all we've seen? That's all we've seen. <laughs> I'm gonna assume quick attack and wing attack, but I mean, who knows? Who knows who cares, it's gone. Okay, and Fero. That's a little bit more intimidating though. I will go into my Flareon against that. Flareon's still like the staple strong Pokemon. Luxray, don't get me wrong. It's a very, very good Pokemon, but Flareon has that little bit of bulk, you know? And that bulk is really worth it. We're gonna give the flame wheel to the our speed, goes for the agility, so he wastes a turn. Haha, <laughs> you fool! You fool. I love watching when people do that. It's, it's the best feeling. It's like, you know what? You messed up. You wasted a turn. Thank you for basically allowing me to be going faster, you know? 
And then you get people who just don't learn from their mistakes. Never mind, okay. Shush, I need to go into Flareon. Flareon is my strongest Pokemon. I needed my strongest Pokemon for that, you know? But I'd keep it Dennis, okay. But I don't think there's any other things down here. We will happily go and run up here. I think this takes us to the top floor. Oh, it doesn't. We do actually have a couple more trainers. Okay. Well, that's a sailor, and sailors normally have war types. So let's bring in Chica and start this off. Sailors are both kind and strong. How about you? you? Could also be fighting types. They are also kind enough for fighting types, so that could be a thing. But it's Politoed. Okay, we should be able to fight this. It's level 32. Damn, you are a strong Politoed. Should I mage power and see what it is? Yes. Yes, I should. We're getting hit by a double slap. Hit twice. They hit twice again. What is this? It turns into try attack. Okay, did I do this before? Maybe. I might have done this before already in this area. I don't know. I don't remember. But that was pretty much a waste of time. Was that loud to anyone else? Or was that just me? Okay, right. Uh, Parish song. I mean, I guess it is a song. I think we just cut again and we're good. I don't think we're gonna be able to have anything terrible happen. It's not like anything crazy is happening with him recovering and, and shadow tagging or anything weird. He just wasted a turn because we do enough damage. That's all that happened? Good. That's what I want to see. None of that perish long shenanigan. It's a horrible move when it actually gets off though. It's a horrible way to go. <laughs> Being like shadow tagged and all that stuff. Mmm. Not fun. But, we can quite happily go into the next sailor fight. You should be the last guy, I'm pretty sure, so let's get you out of the way. I wanted to battle Jasmine, but she's not up to it now. How about you? I'm... I'm up to it, you know? I'm up to it. Thanks for asking. He actually asked me if I wanted to battle. Look at that. My answer obviously doesn't matter, but hey, he asked. And you know what? That's polite. That's very polite. Now, Wingo, can you get cut in the face? Yep, yeah, it got cut in the face. And then Machoke. Buff. It's your time. Show him your wings. Farfetched, you're about to fly, okay? Kinda. You're kinda about to fly. Aerialize him. Aerialize him and crit him. One shot him. That's what I want to see. I want to see a one shot right now. Oh, yes, Farfetch. Buff, okay. Because the more times I see Buff doing good things, the more my heart is slightly healed for the trouble we had to go through to get it, you know? I just, I just want to feel a little bit better about how we got it. That's all. That's all I want. I just want to feel complete. <laughs> but this should take us up to the top, and it does. And we have Amphi! Hello? It's breathing is slight. I'm sad about this, honestly. I'm happy because I know we help it, but I'm sad at the moment because it's a sick Pokemon, you know? This Pokemon always kept a seal at night. But, it suddenly got sick. It's gasping for air. I understand that there is a wonderful pharmacy in Cyanwood. But, that's across the sea. And I can't leave Amphi unattended. Um... I don't get why you'd want the door locked anyway, but, okay. May I ask you to go and get some medicine for me, please? Uh, yes. 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 Absolutely. Absolutely, entirely, yes. So, with that out of the way, we can go and take the elevator back down. You know, why they didn't just have the elevator available, I don't think it's ever really clear. Like, I get why, in a way, Jasmine was, you know, doing a private thing, making sure Amphi was okay, but like, just make the elevator accessible, goddammit. What about if more people came to help? What would you do then? We should buy super potions. Let's do that. Let's do that smart thing that I need to do more. Uh, let's buy... We have, a, we have a fair bit of money, actually. I'm gonna buy 20. That seems like a lot. Especially when we're gonna be needing hype versions really soon anyway. But, I'm okay with it. Uh, and here we can buy quick balls and airmail. And... Yeah, those. <laughs> that airmail that everyone wants. Um, right, let's go and heal up. Once we've healed up, we should be... That reminds me. Wasn't there meant to be a chick in the lighthouse? The flag set woman. She never turned up in the lighthouse. 
I'm so confused about that still. I am so confused. But anyway, ignoring that, I think we do actually have a TM we can go and grab. If we go and surf to the right here, I hope I'm going in the right spot. I might be slightly out, but I believe we get Charge Beam if we go around here. This isn't a different encounter, right? I don't think so. It would be dupes anyway if it was. That's what I want to see. This is still Olivine. Still Olivine. Still Olivine. So this is not no encounter. Thankfully, it's a wing girl. You know, you never really want to wing girl at the end of the day. But round here, we do get ourselves Thunderbolt. Uh, sorry, what? Uh, that's 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 a Thunderbolt. That's a very important TM. Okay. All right. I thought that was going to be Charge Beam, but you know what? Thunderbolt is much better. Okay. I'm excited now. Can anyone learn it? That's important. I mean, it's not. It's not a bad thing to have on a Luxray, because Luxray does have a very strong special attack set, don't get me wrong. But, I want it to have move coverage. It has 76 special attack, though. But Guts, you know Guts, that thing, that thing that's fun, it's, all, it's absolutely certainly better than Tackle, in every way. But I want to believe we're going to get a better move. A lot of Pokemon got move reworks, I don't know for a fact about Luxray, but I really hope it does get another move. I want it to get... Maybe the Fang moves? The Fang moves would be pretty good. If it could get Ice Fang, that would be amazing. But I am not 100% sure on anything like that. I can dream. I can dream it'll get Ice Fang. If it doesn't get a new move before, like, level... Uh, before the next gym, maybe? I don't know. Before a point where we feel like we need it, if it doesn't have a move by then, then I'll teach it Thunderbolt. But either way, that is a very good thing to have. So, with that out of the way, let's go ahead and start towards Cyanwood. So we don't have our Route 40 encounter. Something to be a little bit clear about. We did make sure we got an Olivine encounter there in that tiny little patch of war there. Right. Hey, great waves here. No one can resist such good waves. I really could, you know? The waves aren't that appealing, you know? Glad to meet you. I'm Monica of Monday. I've stumbled across several of these people now. <laughs> As a token of our friendship, I have a gift for you. Uh, that's not the worst. Lyra, go away. I have a beak to look at, and I value looking at an odd beak some lady just gave me more than your phone call. I think we've determined your place in this game. <laughs> but we're gonna give that to Buff, because I don't think Buff really needs the Quick Claw. I think the Quick Claw would be better on... This is a tough decision, actually. I'm tempted to go with Combuskin. I mean, do I need it on Chica? What does Chica have? Oh, I guess that's important. Okay, no, you should definitely keep that. Yeah, yeah, okay. I guess it goes to Combuskin. I would give it to Carmex, because Carmex is slower, but Carmex has priority. So if it needs to go first at a point, it has priority rather than relying on a quick fall. So we'll give it to KFC. That sounds like a good trade. I don't think we have anyone else that has anything important. We have Hardstone, but we don't have any Rock-type moves, so that's a problem. Uh, we don't need a Soothe Bell for anything, because nothing evolves through happiness, and nothing has returned. We get TM63 Embargo. Olivine is the place of TMs. That's this place entirely. They say schools of Fione sometimes cross the warm sea here. But can I please have one of those? Yes. You might encounter one if you're really lucky. I'd like to see one. That Pokemon you have behind you. Sorry, it's not Fione. So, it's... I can definitely get one of those, because she would not be talking about that if I couldn't. And there have definitely been other Pokemon that would not be in this game, that are in this game. Namely being, well, the first one that comes to my mind being Spiritomb. Because there's an event for Spiritomb in this game. Because we got given the odd keystone, so that's a thing. What? I'm the first to arrive. There will soon be a battle frontier past here. I don't want to do that, actually. You know what? Nah, I'm good. I'm good. I could wait there in line, but I don't think things would ever progress, you know? Uh, so I think we want to surf here. I would love to not get a war type right now, but I don't think we have that luxury, you know? Alright, let's battle this guy though first things first, make sure we get all this out of the way. Train up our beauty- I did say I was going to evolve this guy, didn't I? I did say I was going to wreck candy, my bay leaf. We're still gaining so much XP, there's not really a need. Like, look at how much XP we're actually gaining, just casually. I'm not going to use the Wreck Handy just yet. I don't see the need for it. Are you going to Cyanwood? How about a quick battle first? 
Look at these people with question marks at the end. I thought that was a shiny love disc for a second there. Oh, my heart. <laughs> I thought it was like, is that weirdly timid? Is that really a love disc sprite? I thought it was brighter than that. That's weird. That's really weird. I know, right? I'm, I'm having a fit because love disc doesn't look exactly in this pristine condition. I am a love disc inspector, okay? They have to look perfect in my eyes. <sighs> Seeing a, a poor... <laughs> that sort of colour. That sort of colour is what I want on my love disc, but that sort of course I want. I'm gonna shut up. <laughs> love disc is not that important of a Pokemon. It's a, it's a cute Pokemon, but it's it's there for fun, not for actual competitive play. Octillery, hmm. Ah, this Pokemon. This Pokemon is in a weird spot with me. I don't like this Pokemon, and it's purely because of its evolution. If this was a standalone Pokemon, I would love this Pokemon because it would be so derpy and it would be great. But it evolves from Remoraid, and that's so weird. It's so weird to me. I don't like that evolution. I get it. I get everything behind it. I know all of the theories behind it, but it just doesn't make sense. <laughs> it's just still a little bit weird. It's worse than Trap Inch into Flygon for me. Right, are we evolving though? We are evolving. It is time to have some bulk on this team, which will make me feel a lot better. I like having Pivot. I like having a Pokemon we can swap into casually and not worry about dying. Hopefully this will be that Pokemon. Has a lot of weaknesses, being a grass type, but we should be good. Look at this beautiful Meganium. Learn Solar Beam. That's good enough. That's, yep, that's Solar Beam. Okay, <laughs> all right, I'll take it. Uh, this is a risky move. It's better than Tackle. Did I say I was gonna get rid of Nature Power or Tackle? I was gonna get rid of one of them for Giga Drain, but honestly, if we have Petal Dance, that's a lot stronger. I mean, how often have we used Poison Powder? But we can... That's there for a pinch, you know? I think we get rid of Tackle. I don't see a time when we're going for Tackle instead of Petal Dance, you know? If we're relying on Tackle, we probably want a Poison Powder and use another move or swap anyway. So we're gonna get rid of Tackle, because Nature Power still has some use. I feel like this is the play. Nature Power can still become Earthquake, so it's always gonna be somewhat viable in certain areas. Especially because... Yes. Yes. Bye, Nature Power. What was that I was saying about Earthquake? Sorry, I have to... No, no, we don't need Earthquake no more. We have Earth Power now. This Pokemon just got so strong? What? We get Earth Power? Sorry, is Earth Power nerfed? I have to check. We got straight up Earth Power. Yo, this Pokemon is so strong. We are actually stronger on physical attack, and that really sucks right now. That does really suck right now, but honestly, that's super good. This just became an amazing Pokemon to have. Okay, that's incredible. I'm honestly a little bit bewildered. Right, back to catching Pokemon though. Who do I even want in front anymore? I'm afraid Chica might just kill everything. Uh, yeah, Chica might just kill everything. I'll keep Buff in front, because Buff won't kill everything. Uh, we get TM88 Pluck. Can we stop getting TMs, please? <laughs> Can we stop? I get it. Okay, you didn't want to give me too many TMs early on, you know, you want to fit a lot of them as middle of the pack, because a lot of TMs are kind of average. I get it. But, goddamn. Right, our encounter for Route 40, though, finally, is going to be a... It's a Wingull. It's a Wingull. Okay. It's not the strongest, most exciting Pokemon in the world. It is. I get that. But... But it survived, and it's an encounter. Okay, right, that was a little bit close. <laughs> I, was, I was really trying to think of what, what's good about it, and it nearly died to a crit. Okay. 
Okay, I don't I don't need that with my heart right there, but Great Ball should catch this thing easily. I don't see any struggle with a Wing Girl. Uh hmm. I mean this thing is toilet bird. It's it's toilet bird. It evolves into toilet bird. I can't I can't not call it Toilet Bird when I've already called it Toilet Bird, you know? It's... That would just be an insult. It's what it is. <laughs> oh dear, is that even gonna fit? Oh, it fits perfectly. It was meant to be. It was actually meant to be. This is what I want to see, you know? Honestly, I'd sooner rather... I'd sooner use the Hoo-Hoo, if I'm perfectly honest. If I needed a flying type, but if I need a water type... I'm clearly using Piplup. There's no reason. I'm not going to use that anytime soon. But it's there in case everything goes wrong. Last case scenario. It is there. It is available. Right. Back to battling people though. And hopefully, we shouldn't have any problems now. Because if anything does get scary, I think I can close combat you. Nice and easy. If anything does look scary... Oh, we get Night Slash. Hey. Uh. Hmm. Hmm. This is an interesting predicament. Uh, I kind of like the moves I have. Flying fighting is pretty good coverage. I don't think I want that. I kind of want to keep Sword Stance for the off chance we get like a complete sweep. Night Slash is high crit. We have a crit based ability. I get it. But I'm going to keep the moves that we have. But we should be fine against any Pokemon really in this area because they're all going to be water types and we just got the most Powerful. In fact, let's just use Pal Balance. I just, I just want to use it once. Okay. He has a lot of Pokemon left. Is this smart? Yes, because we can always swap out after we kill it. Use the move. Use the move. Look at those petals. Go. Oh, it's so beautiful. You're dead. You're dead, Wyoma. You are dead. You're gone. There's, there's no surviving that. You know. It's so OP. It's so OP. Clampo. No, I'm keeping it going. Bye. Oh, this is nice. Alright, now that we're in that situation where there's Barboge coming in, we can swap into Tarmex, give it that little bit of XP it needs to evolve. Nice and easy, just like that. Not to evolve, to level up. A little bit different. <laughs> we're not evolving it just yet. Alright, but what about you? What do you have? No inflatable tube for me? Well, well, isn't that good for you? Damn. I'm jealous. Uh, I'm gonna Source Dance right here. Finion, you want to calm down with that super effective gust right there? I see you. On the one hand, I could close combat this Pokemon at plus two. On the other hand, it's Patches. I could Earth Power Patches. I feel horrible. I don't want to do this. If there's a Pokemon I actually want to get, it's Patches. I love this Pokemon. I don't know why. It just grew on me more and more. Patches. Up power isn't even the right play here, it's definitely the battle dance, but I'm gonna up power anyway. <laughs> uh, don't signal me and me and one shot me with a super crit or ice beam or anything like that. Just be patches and just be tanky. Yep, look at that. Take down. Should I have petal danced? Yes. Yes, I should have. But oh well. Uh, cut should still kill, because its physical defense is lower, our physical attack is higher, loads of things to take into account. Do I care though? No. No. Not at all. I'm just happy that it's Meganium right now. Meganium, a Pokemon that is quite often underrated, has become much stronger purely because of one move. Earth Power. Route 41! Can I avoid that route? Route 40. Okay. Can't really avoid it. Do I have a repel? Because I want to go into a cave or I mean a cave will be counted as a different route, won't it? Really? Really? <laughs> God damn it. Okay, that's another part of the glitch, where the glitch happens when you go into your menu. But we're gonna be going on to Route 41. I do believe we are about to get potentially another Don't be a wing girl. In fact, just don't be something trash. <gasps> I'll take a man tyke? Hell yes! Okay. This passes. This passes. This gets pass. Don't get me wrong. Typing wise, absolutely not going to be useful. But it's a man type, and I can always deal with a man type. <laughs> this sounds really stupid, but you know what? If it had been like a Goldeen, I'd have been so sad. But a man type, it it gets a slight buff. It's never evolving. I just need to clarify that right now. This is a man type. That's it. 
That, that's the end of it. It's a man type. Never a man type. Never. Because you have to evolve with Remoraid in your party. And unless we randomly get Remoraid, it's staying a man type. It has War Absorb. Okay, I hope you can live a bite then. Freaking man type, man. <laughs> this sucks. <laughs> this really sucks, but it's kind of funny. I want to go into the Elite Four with a man type. <laughs> That would be the worst, but the funniest experience. Oh, just a level 100 man type getting wrecked by every single Pokemon in the Elite Four. How hard are you to catch? You're actually hard to catch though, aren't you? Just to spite me. Yeah, you are. I forgot your catch rate. Sometimes a Pokemon just wants to be Premier, you know? Just wants to be that high class Pokemon. I get it. Mantype, the kite Pokemon. When it swims close to the surface of the ocean, people aboard ships are able to observe the power on its back. Okay. Uh, do we want to give a nickname? Yes. Uh, you need a cute nickname. I want to call you... I want to call you... I'm just going to call you Flip. <laughs> you're just... You're just Flip. What <laughs> do I want to call you Flippy? Flippy sounds cute. Let's go Flippy. We're just Flippy. It's never evolving, it never needs to have a badass name. It's just there to be cute and stupid. It's basically perfect, honestly. <laughs> uh, Whirlpool's also a thing in this game, I had forgotten about that. It's another Mantike, okay. The Mantike squad is here on this route, I like it. Uh, okay, what do you have? Oh! Oh, uh, mm. Yeah, that's a little bit stronger than I was expecting. Uh, mm. Mm-hmm. If we get in with Scar, we should be fine. It's level five it's a level 33 Gaudis. If that thing hits me with a frash, I'm taking a lot of health. I don't know if it's I don't know if Gyarados' moves got changed. If Gyarados has like waterfall. Holy hell, that would hurt. So I'm gonna go into Chica. I'm gonna play it safe for the time being, purely because I don't know what this Pokemon has. I just know its base stats are crazy, and I know they didn't get changed. It has Leer. I mean, at the end of the day, I do regret it a lot right now. We have speed on Chica as well, so we should. I'm very. I'm gonna swap. I'm gonna swap right here. He's gone for Twister and Leer. That shows me the same move set. Might have Frash. I don't think Frash will one shot. Dragon Rage cannot ever one-shot, so that's really good. He showed three moves that I know definitely cannot kill me. So, we go for Spark and we should be really good. This should just kill. But sometimes I underestimate Gyarados' bulk. It is four times super effective from a Luxray, but sometimes I underestimate his bulk. But not today. Not today. Okay, we're good. We hit level 33, which is nice. Ice Fang. Give me that Ice Fang. That'd be the best feeling in the world. No Ice Fang. Okay, that's sad. That does upset me a little bit. It does. But it's fine. It'll get it one day, I believe. Uh, I feel bad for my two fire types that I have right now that are just kind of chilling in the back. Completely useless, you know? But I'm gonna actually ignore that chick and just continue. Uh, Sianwood City. I'm gonna use a Repel right here. Because I don't want my encounter to be used up right here. Right, now that we have landed, if we can get given a Pokemon, because I believe we can get given a Shuckle, I mean, do we really want a Shuckle? At the end of the day, I don't think I really want a Shuckle. Maybe it would be better just to get another water type, honestly. I don't know. A Shuckle is never really going to be useful at the end of the day. Sure, I could wrap something and then die, but like, why? <laughs> why would I want that, you know? Uh, oh well. Let's speak to some people. Pokemon at this gym are all rough and tough. They could blow me away in a second. Let me give you a piece of advice. The gym leader uses fighting type Pokemon. I have a sword styling Farfetch. You can try to fool them with psychic type Pokemon, or simply defeat them before they demonstrate their power. By the way, Chuck, the gym leader, is into his waterfall training. He won't be able to hear you unless you somehow stop the pounding water. Hoo-ha! Through singular discipline, we will reign supreme. We will be strong. We will prevail. Hoo-ha! There's a nifty little item I'd like to give you for watching us. That, you know, when strangers watch you doing weird things, you don't give them goodies. You say, go away, I'm not that weird. So there's a choice man. Oh, yes. 
Oh, yes. <laughs> That's all I want to say right now, just yes. <laughs> have you met the maniac in this city? He's always bragging about his rare Pokemon. Uh, I mean, I'll have a look. You can't help showing off the Pokemon you have, don't you agree? I'd love to show mine to a friend. Yeah, I don't, I don't care. Um, I don't really show mine off. I have a Farfetch'd at the end of the day. If I went around showing off a Farfetch'd, they'd probably think I was crazy. So, I'm good. Uh, I'm gonna deposit KFC quickly. It's not gonna be off the team or anything. It's just because I think I'm gonna pick up a new Pokemon somewhere, so... I just want to have the party spot available. Right, let's go get our goodies, though. I apologize, but wait for supplies. Could you come back later? I do have to get the gym badge first, don't I? Okay. I've heard these special items wash up on the coast west of here. They're supposedly related to a Pokemon that produces pearls. Clan pearls? Evolutionary items? I guess? Uh, what do you... I, I'm in shock. A guy about your age with piercing eyes and long hair came in. He scared me into giving him my prized Pokemon. I still have one left. What if he comes back? He looks strong. Could you look after my Pokemon for a while? It's a free Pokemon. At the end of the day. It's, like, it's, a, it's basically a static encounter. I'm not against this, but if I'm going to take the giveaway Pokemon in an area, I don't know how I feel about getting an actual encounter, you know? It's, uh, it's a weird thing. It's a weird thing that I'm heavily debating. I'm not 100% sure on it myself. Which probably seems really stupid, but you know. We got ourselves a Shuckle. It's a relaxed nature, so at least that's helpful. Look at those defenses. God damn, that's so disgusting. It has Bide Construct. Bide doesn't even work well with Shuckle because it doesn't have any HP. Oh, this Pokemon sucks. <laughs> oh, I don't know how I feel about that at all. I will actually just release it. I wouldn't even care. You can't just fly about this badge. Blah, 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 blah. I'll earn the badge, okay? And then we will have a flying far-fetched. Provided it can learn fly, I hope it can. Hey kids and Gligar, the best Pokemon. I'm gonna get either a Razor Claw or a Razor Fang here. Ooh. 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 I don't want to speak to either of them yet, because I don't know if I'm gonna get either of their evolutions. And if I ever get an evolution that can evolve through one of them, I can come back here. Let's let's think this through. Hi, you must be a sightseer. Why not take a picture here? You saw the camera outside? I put it there. You make it- uh, no. No, 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 no. No, it's gonna sound really stupid considering I'm on a webcam right now, but I really don't like having my picture taken, so... <laughs> it sounds really stupid. It's probably the main reason why I don't look at the camera too much, if anyone's wondering. That's probably the reason. If you use Fly, you can get back to Olivine instantly. That's a very good point. Oh, hello. A Pikachu was washed up on the shore. It seems it was surfing, but collapsed. It could do for a kind trainer to take care of it. Oh, are you a trainer? That Pokemon leading a pie. No, never mind. Uh, yes? Yes? It's very happy, isn't it? Perhaps. Are you telling me Buff isn't happy? Okay, I may have called Buff a murderer several thousand times off camera, but still, it should be happy. Perhaps, would you be willing to take care of this Pikachu? I am very tempted to click no, but it's a free Pokemon. Excellent, I'm very glad to hear it. Here you go. You can't accept this Pikachu, your pie is completely full. God damn it, Shuckle. I didn't mean to take you anyway. <laughs> You're getting out of here, Shuckle. God damn it. No, I didn't mean to speak to you. I wanted to speak. To, I wanted to speak to, speak to the computer. Okay. I don't know how I feel about this. I don't know how I feel about this, but it's a giveaway Pokemon, so it's not against Nuzlocke rules. <sighs> to be honest, enough. As long as you get one Pokemon per area that you actively encounter, that's basically Nuzlocke rules. So this is fine, I just don't like it. <laughs> but, okay. I'm basically just doing this because I want to see if it actually has surf. That's the main reason. Thank you. Do you know of the Battle Frontier? We may meet again if you visit the Battle Castle. A battle? No, I cannot do that. I am sorry. Thank you again. Why can I never remember that person's name? 
Never remember it. I just know that I like that person. A surf and fly. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it so much. You don't understand how much I hate it. Oh, surf, fly, Pikachu. Yeah, great. <sighs> So stupid. There are new residents in that house up there. They said they're tutors. Oh! Wait, yes. Uh, I don't care about Rock Smash. Sweet guns over there, though. Alright, let's speak to you. Me, I'm the Pokemon Move Maniac. I know every move that a Pokemon can learn while they're leveling up, but I can make Pokemon remember those moves. Yes. 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 Need a heart scale. If I get heart scale, that means that my Luxray could potentially learn Ice Fang? Is that what you're telling me? Because that's giving me hope. And you're the move deleter. I can delete cut. And learn Giga Drain. I see no negative. I don't think we need cut again. Um. I don't think we need cut again. If we do. I could always go and give it to a different Pokemon. Yeah, I think I'm gonna get rid of Cut. It's not a bad move by any means. Or, not as bad as it used to be, but still a little bit lackluster. So, this should be fine. I'm okay with doing that. And now we can teach you Giga Drain nice and easily. Uh, it might land Giga Drain naturally. Ah, oh, when else am I gonna use this TM? When else am I gonna use this TM? Let's be honest, I should just give it to Chica straight up. Yeah, have Giga Drain. I feel better about that. I feel like that was a good improvement. Now we have that little bit of HP regen and all that good stuff. Uh, I guess we should go and get this over and done with. Uh, Combustion's probably still on the layout, because I don't actually want to use this Pikachu, and I don't think we have a fight here. Do we fight anyone here? Or does Suicune just run away? So Suicune runs away, but this guy pops up, and that's battle music. God damn it. Yo, Carlos, wasn't that Suicune just now? I only caught a quick glimpse, but I thought I saw Suicune running on the waves. Suicune is beautiful and grand. It races through towns and roads at simply awesome speeds. It's gotta go fast. It's wonderful. I want to see Suicune up close. I've decided. I'll battle you as a trainer to earn Suicune's respect. Come on, Carlos. Let's battle now. I don't want to. <laughs> can, that, can that be an option? Can I just be like, actually, no. No. Let's not. Hypno. Yeah, let's not. Honestly, I don't want to fight this Hypno. Best thing I can do is probably go into Luxray, so I'm just gonna do that. Oh, you... Ugh. I hate Hypno. <laughs> and I hate Hypnosis. He's a madman! He's an absolute madman! Get Night Slash, get out of here. You are not setting up on me. I don't know what you have, but you've scared me. Please die to this. Choice Band, okay. Choice Band. Choice Band, don't bring a, don't do a war type right now. Don't do it. Mm -mm. Electrode, I could stay in. But we have Earth Power. We have Earth Power, so there's no reason for me not to go in Earth Power at the end of the day. Except Signal Beam. But he doesn't take a beam, he thunders instead, which is kind of terrifying. But we're a bulky Meganium with coverage. Feels good. Feels good to have this thing evolved, actually. This needed to evolve. Bayleaf? Probably my favorite of the evolution line, appearance-wise, personality-wise, because of the anime, because it was funny as hell. But overall, Meganium's just a lot better, <laughs> you know? If you give an Eviolite to Bayleaf, different story. Uh, Rotom, though, what do I want to do against you? Again, Luxray is like the best Pokemon right now. I don't know how I feel about this matchup. I think we're okay. I'm actually going to go for one Night Slash to see what he does. He sets up a Reflect for his team. Not a bad play, actually. We are Choice Banded. This is a high crit move. This could still do a lot. Okay, that, that wasn't much. I'm gonna go for another one. He's gonna leech seed. Please don't be sub seed. Don't be sub seed. Just if there's any one thing I don't want to see right now, it would be sub seed. 
That would be the absolute worst thing. Gonna go for one more Night Slash. He clearly doesn't have anything for me. He's going for Reflect, Leech Seed, Aerial Ace. He probably has a Grass-type move. I'd assume. I could be wrong. Can we get a crit here? Okay. Alright. No crits for me. I see how it is. Uh, I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna go for the Night Slash. I'm not afraid of this jump left, you know? Oh, although when it's that low, I'm gonna swap. Because I don't want to get my luck strike killed, you know? I did some damage. Uh, we are gonna bite here. Sounds weird, but I wasn't sure if he was gonna swap. I'm gonna go for bite, nice and simple. Jump off is a stupidly fast Pokemon as well, for some reason. For some reason, they made that Pokemon really fast. I don't get it. Uh, against the Electrode though, we go back into Chica. We go for the Earth Power back here, basically how we started off. You can go for Thunder again if you want. We know we live this just fine. Nice and easy, nice and quick pacing. Let's keep this going. Rotom wants to come in. Hmm. I'm gonna stay in, actually. And just Giga Dream and get a lot of health back. Some nice health back, actually. I believe a Petal Dance of this health should kill, so I'm just gonna take Petal Dance. Okay, good. <laughs> if that hadn't have killed, that would have been horrible. Sweet Scent, we already tried to learn that, and I don't care for it, but okay, there we go. You're amazing, Carlos. I'm starting to understand why Suicune was keeping an eye on you. I'm, st I'm going to keep searching for my Suicune. Blah, 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 Suicune, 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 Suicune. You have a serious obsession, my dude. You need to stop. Do we get an item here? No, we don't. Sucks. Well, we got an item there. Huh. But I think that's where we wrap up this episode with our flying, surfing Pikachu in our party. Um, yeah, that's a thing. Uh, honestly, we might have to change around who's on the team. I don't know if Combuskin is the strongest Pokemon to have. I'm very tempted to try and get a Nidoqueen. So I might go for Nidoqueen in between episodes. I'm gonna say, for the time being, Nido Queen is gonna be on our pie. I'm not 100% sure right now, but I'd rather have a Nido Queen than a flying surfing Pikachu. No jokes. Plus, its typing kinda works with the next gym being a fighting type gym. So hopefully that'll all work out. For now though, if you guys have enjoyed this episode, leave a like down below, hit that subscribe button, and without further ado, bye!